Hi all, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your daily vibes for Sunday, February 25th. This is for all signs. Daily vibes for Sunday, February 25th. Now, this may not resonate. I have to throw that out there because, you know, the hundreds and thousands of people watch these readings. There's no way I could connect with every single person. Generally, I connect pretty well, but we will see what comes up. I just heard a boom. I don't know where that boom came from. You might hear my dog growl in a minute. This is a new beginning, okay? The Page of Cups, this is good news, perhaps. I mean, maybe it's a birth, it could be a birth, it could be a new relationship. Either way, it's good news, all right? There's unexpected and welcome good news. <laughs> Strength. Strength. This is about mastering your emotions, finding the force within you to prevail, letting go of something, perhaps. Because it's when you're ready to open up and let go, you found the strength to do that, to have your, your, your new beginning in love, perhaps. Or it could be the strength to have a child. <laughs> I don't know what it is because I just happen to keep looking at this child. Um, I got the goosebumps now. Something to do with, with um, oneness, using the force within you. Seven of Wands. You know, it appears that you guys have to stand up for yourself in some way. Maybe you need to stand your ground. Um, fight for love, maybe. Maybe you need to fight for a new beginning in love. Maybe you need to fight for a child. You know, stand up for a child. That could certainly be the case. Maybe you need to find the strength to do what's right for a child. I mean, this is daily vibes. I'm not sure. Let's, let's see what this is. Nine of Swords, oh my goodness, something is going on. Something is going on that is causing some anguish of some sort, okay? And it could have to do with a child. I'm not sure what it is. Maybe one of your children is going through a problem right now, going through a struggle, and you are being called to offer your strength, your wisdom, your guidance, something like that to a child. You know, maybe somebody needs you. That could certainly be the case. It appears, now the goosebumps are big, 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 big. It appears that somebody is definitely going through some sort of struggle, whether it's you or somebody else. There may be an overwhelming feeling of emotions, okay? Because that's what happens with children. Children cry, okay? So there could, somebody could be feeling overwhelmed emotionally because of some depression that they're going through. And you're being called to react with strength, react with confidence, to have courage, to dig deep. Dig really, really deep to find the force within you to overcome this, this uh, depression perhaps or anguish or despair that you're going through. You're being called to stand up for yourself, to fight for yourself, to to um, become stronger, you know, to, to do what you have to do. All right, I'm just going to zoom this in before we go any further. You, you know, you, there's, a, there's a defensive energy here where somebody needs to be, either somebody needs to be defended 
or you feel like you need to be on the defense. Somebody is, is in need of strength, courage, willpower. And even perhaps restraint. Okay? Maybe somebody needs to... I see, I, somebody is going through some mental conflicts that need to be released and that caught in that it, it requires strength to do that. Okay. And the strength is a, is a root strength. Okay. It, it's, it's inner strength. Okay. So I feel like inner strength is needed at this time to release some negative patterns or some negative energies from your life. And it appears to me that as you release these negative patterns, there is a new discovery, perhaps, that comes to you unexpectedly that is welcome, okay? Because the Page of Cups bring in, brings in welcome, brings in good things, okay? So I, it appears to me that somebody is going to use their inner strength to release some negativity. And as they release this negativity, something new and welcome is going to come into their lives. And that's what it appears to be. Okay? So, you know, I have to remind you that this energy, energy could have happened yesterday. Could be happening today. Could be happening tomorrow. Or it could be happening next week. Because the energy is fluid for each one of us as individual in this world. Okay? These are the energies that I am picking up on today. But they could resonate with you whenever they resonate. All right? There is some new, welcome, unexpected news coming into your life. Could be in regards to a birth or a pregnancy or a child. Or it could just be a new relationship. Okay? And you're going to be called to just stand up stand up for yourself in some way okay and maybe you need to let your guard down maybe you're being called to master your emotions and replace your need to defend yourself with grace and tact okay because i see that many of us or many of people that are watching this have been on the defensive we've had our guard up i'm i'm not sure that i can let new love into my life i'm not sure i want new love because you know, my guard is up. I'm not sure that I can trust anybody at this time. And that's where this strength comes in. The strength to, you know, have confidence and allow allow our intuition to lead us. Okay, because this is very intuitive as well. So anyway, it appears to me that somebody has their guard up. There could be somebody new that comes in and we are defensive and not wanting to uh, get hurt. So we may have our, our guard up and we are being called to just go with it. Let go. Let go of the past. Let go of the depression. Let go of the despair. Let go of the anguish. And welcome this new beginning, perhaps. See only love. Interesting. This really plays a part with what I was just saying. See only, see only love. Look past the seeming errors mistakes and misunderstandings takes strength to do that doesn't it it really does and see only the love within each person including yourself like a child does that's what a child does your resolute focus upon the love that underlies every situation brings about healing in undreamed of ways. Look at the situation through a child's eyes. See the situation with love. 
I feel as though there is an opportunity, a new, a new opportunity that could could be presented to you, in which you have your guard up about, and you are being called to see past the errors, see past the see past the past hurt see past the past depression use your strength to master your emotions to let your guard down see it through the eyes of a child see it through innocence give whatever this is a chance don't base it on your past anguish and hurt see only the love in the situation like a child would do Look past the seeming errors, mistakes, and misunderstandings. See only the love within each person, including yourself. Your resolute focus upon the love that underlies every situation brings about healing in undreamed of ways. Find the strength within you to see only love in the situation that you are defending yourself about there's a situation going on in your life where your guard is up and you're on the defensive figure out what that is and see that situation through the eyes of a child through innocence and through love do you have the strength to do that do you or would you rather live in this depressive state of mind that's the nine of swords it's up to you it's, it's mind over matter. That's what strength is. Mind over matter. Okay. Trust. Trust your decisions. March to the beat of your own heart. Again, earlier I was saying trust your intuition because this is very intuitive as well. Trust yourself. And you know, to trust yourself, I believe that is the ultimate strength. So anyway, what I have for you today is let your guard down and try to see love through this situation trust yourself trust your intuition find the inner strength within to release the mental conflict that has been holding you back and so that is what I have for today Talk to you later. Find your strength.